What's going on, his squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all luxury, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Monday, July 26th, and as I say each and every video, Smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the channel, just checking out the cycles, just checking out me in general. Make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. If you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, make sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT. How to spell that is in the intro to the video now. It's down in the left, bottom left hand corner of your screen. It's down below the video and the hashtag is down below the video in the description. And it is the name of the channel. <laughs> so it's everywhere. Uh, if you do want to know Madame Nazar's location or any updates for any of uh, any games that i do play or frequent uh follow me on instagram and twitter and i will be updating you guys for the channel and anything else that i got going on um first things first let's get the madame nazar's location if you've been looking at the map or if you've been playing the game today she's right by the end in new hanover she's right here in Heartlands, right along the Dakota River. She's right here by this old burnt town. I think that's what they call it, the burned down town. But she's right here and she will be here until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know or not of America. <laughs> How I personally get to her when she's in this location is I simply fast travel to Valentine, take the train tracks down this direction. Once I get to this feature series, I take this path down and I continue to go down until I get to the Dakota River right here. And there she is. Uh, there are a couple things over here that I wanted to tell you that's near her so you can grab them while you're over here it's a couple things inside this burn town right here at this location here there's a family heirloom this family here heirloom pull out your metal detector and is inside this broken down house right here you gotta like climb under like climb inside it and pull out your metal detector crouch down a little bit but it's a little task getting that uh, there's an antique alcohol bottle right here inside this building. This this is a cognac bottle, C O G N A C. It's in the sheriff's desk, sheriff's desk right here at this location. And right back here at this little dot right here, there's I think this is an outhouse. And inside this broken down outhouse, there's a page of pinnacles right there. If you guys want to cross the way. There's a flower here. That flower is a chocolate daisy. And there's a lost jury right here on this side of the water next to this uh, little path here. Right here at this location, you guys will get a random lost jury. It's in the triangle of trees is right here. So grab that. Uh, Any, the next thing I want to tell you guys about is the Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle, which is up here, all the way up here, so you guys can see, all the way up here at the word window rock, right here inside this shack. Uh, you basically can run back up to Valentine, but if you do have the fast travel in your wilderness camp, if you don't, you can buy it, but go. Go to Valentine and just take this path up here and go through the Cumberland Forest. Take this path down and around and the Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle is right here inside this shack. It's 
to your left directly as soon as you walk through the door. So you can't miss it. There's... I was going to say that there was there was also there's a, a random item right here if you guys guys want to get it. But let's go down here to where we normally do business, which is the Lemoyne area of the map. Zoom in as much as I can. We do have one up there, but this is basically what we got going on right now. The cycles for today, Monday, July 26, are. Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All of Azuri Cycle 6, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 4, Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 3, All Terror Card Cycle 2, Bird Egg Cycle 5, and Fossils Cycle 5. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles, the a link to a video for the current cycle of Fossils. So I can try to help you guys find those and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Let's go through these items and I will tell you what we will find across the Lemoyne area of the map while we're over here. Right over here near this elimination series, kind of a little bit. Don't go that far, but hit that little left right there. Go across the bridge that's there. And right into this little farm. Uh, in this house, there's a antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is a old time gin bottle. It's in the sink cupboard. <coughs> That's right underneath the sink. A little cabinet area right there. Go and grab that antique alcohol bottle. Once again, that is a old time gin bottle. Let's uh, see what else I can get for you guys. Down here at our first marker. Right between the M&A of, of Marsh. Right here at this location, pull out your metal detector and you guys will get a random fossil. I cannot tell you what fossil you will get because it is randomized. Uh, down a little bit next to this dot here. Right here on this side of the dot. Right there at that location. You guys will get a random coin. I cannot tell you guys what coin you will get. But come right here at that location and pull out your metal detector once again. And that's what it will be, a random coin. Uh, go. Let's go over here near Harriet at this location between the shoreline and a couple trees. I say two or three trees. Right here at this location, watch your metal detector one more time. And you guys will get a random arrowhead. I cannot tell you guys what arrowhead it will be, but I know that's what's there in that location. I have a couple things right here for you guys. One is a tarot card on this dock. On one of the posts, there's a six of swords. And there's a random lost jury right here. If you pull out your metal detector right here at this location, that's what you will dig up. A random lost jury. Uh, before we go over too far, let's go over here in this little locay area. Right here at this L-shaped shack, where our next marker is, you guys will get a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a goat hairbrush. It's right at the back of the shack, inside the shack, on a bench right here at this location. There's also a lost jury. A random lost jury right here at this location. So pull out your metal detector right here next to the skull altar. And that's what you will get. A random lost jury right here inside this square here. Right here. This is a small shack or something like that. Right inside this small shack on a table. You guys will get a four of wands tarot card. Down just a little bit underneath the N and NWA right here inside this house you guys will get two things actually one is a lost jury this lost jury is a Durant Pearl bracelet this Durant Pearl bracelet is on the mantle of the fireplace so it's on top of the fireplace and on one of the tables inside the house there's the Irish whiskey antique alcohol bottle so go and grab that as well 
uh, let's go down to this marker here right here across the water right here at this location you guys will get a bird egg this bird egg is a egret egg egret it's in the tree shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow if this bird egg is not here you may have to switch lobbies because sometimes this bird egg does not appear for me personally uh, let's go down a little bit to this next marker, which this marker is a coin. This coin is randomized. I cannot tell you what it is, but come over here at this location. There's a small, like a broken down cart, like a very small wagon or cart right here at this location. Go buy that cart with your metal detector and you will dig up a random coin. There's also a card on the ledge of the stairway of this building this card is a king of cups right here at this location uh, let's go across the water to this backyard right here right here in this backyard there's a very large tree go to that large tree with your metal detector and you guys will dig up a random lost jury I cannot tell you guys what lost jury you will dig up but that's what you will get Let's go across the way to this backyard right here. Right here inside this backyard, on a table, there's a cherry wood comb here. This cherry wood comb is on a table. It's like backyard furniture, like outside patio furniture, white patio furniture and stuff. Right there on the table, you guys will see that cherry wood comb. Let's go over a little bit more. I have another item for you guys. Right here next to the D and the knee, right here at this location, you guys will get a ivory hairpin. This ivory hairpin is on the table as well, but this table is like a metal table. Go right through the gate, and that's what you guys will see, a metal table. Just grab the ivory hairpin off of it, and there you go. Let's go up to the cemetery just a little bit right here at this location. You guys will get a tarot card. This tarot card is a Knight of Wands. It's right here in this mausoleum right here at this location. You enter right here at the front where the marker is. And there you go. Let's uh, go down to our last marker, which was our last marker before we start leaving the city. Right here at this location, you guys will get the Cardinal Flower that spawns over here. In this area each and every day that helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on and today is cycle five <laughs> Almost said six. Um, let's go over to this last marker which right here at this location there's a big tree right here by this big tree pull out your metal detector and you guys will get a random another random arrowhead um, there's not much else I can say to explain that to you. There's a very large tree. Walk up to it, pull out your metal detector, and that's what you will get. A random arrowhead. If you guys do want to travel down here at the bottom of this part of the map, right here inside this house, you guys will get a Tennessee whiskey antique alcohol bottle. It's in the cabinet in the living room. Um, let's go up to the Thor board. Thor, Thor bar. the Braithwaite Manor home right here inside this mansion you guys will get a family heirloom this family heirloom is a jade hairpin this jade hairpin is on top of the fireplace second floor first room to the left on top of the fireplace the mantle uh, let's go up to Rose where I have a couple more things for you guys one is right here at this saloon let's see if we can show you guys that boom right at the back of that saloon there's a terrace go up the stairs into the terrace area there's a little dining area and on one of the tables you guys will get a knight of swords tarot card and right over here by this barn there's a bench on that bench you guys will get a four of cups tarot card and I have two more things for you guys before we start to close out the video, which is one, a random lost jury right in front of the scarecrow right here at this location under 
the Essence Southfield Flats. And over here inside this house, there's a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a New Guinea Rosewood hairbrush. This New Guinea Rosewood hairbrush is in a chest, a treasure chest, in one of the bedrooms that's here inside this house. Uh, that's pretty much it for all the extras that I have for you guys. I'm going to try to zoom in as much as I can so you guys can see everything. The cycles for today, Monday, July 26th, once again are Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Luxury Cycle 6, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 4, Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 3, All Terror Card Cycle 2, Bird Egg Cycle 5, and Fossils Cycle 5. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Luxury Cycle 6, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 4, Wildflower Cycle 5, <coughs> Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 5, excuse me. Antique Alcohol Bottle, no. Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 3, All Terror Card Cycle 2, Bird Egg Cycle 5, and Fossil Cycle 5. Remember, if I mess up in any type of way, if you aren't sure, check the description box below because the cycles will be down there for you guys. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils so I could, the video that I made tries to pinpoint exactly where each and every fossil is on the map. So I, I try to help you guys find those if you guys want to find them. I, those give you a, a pretty good amount of money if you go looking for those. Um, and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Thank you guys for watching, looking, listening, liking, sharing, subscribing, commenting, and everything else you do. I do, uh, I do appreciate it so so much. And each and every bit, we are so so close to that 300 mark. Um, let's get that. Let's get past that. Let's blow right through that goal. <laughs> Um, if you haven't, if you don't, if you, uh, do not yet, make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. <laughs> it's your baby man here, man, once again, and I'm out.